Alright, we're heading on into Serendipity to pick up a uh, fragment skill. This must be the goddess's will. Please, let time, the world, escape the nightmare it faces. Monster skill, or fragment skill, monster collector. I believe we get this one for completing all of the fragments in the Vile Peaks areas, which is kind of pretty cool. So, uh, we're gonna head on out, go to Yasha's Massif 01XAF. I don't know. I like dogs myself. Even after death, she continues to pay for her mistake. My heart goes out to that poor girl. Alright, this is the one that, uh, that we had decided not to do earlier. If you wanna set her free, I won't stop you. But remember, even though she used to be a human being, she's a monster now. Stay on your toes out there, or you'll end up losing your life. I mean, I don't hate cats, I just prefer dogs. Kind of an animal person in general, but cats and I just don't normally get along together. Here we are, the Gorgyra Fragment. She looks interesting. Gorgyra is a very interesting fight. She's not overly difficult at my level. But at a lower level, she'd be almost deadly. Uh, she does this debuffing aura thing. And uh, it seems as long as this aura is out, she continues to add debuffs to, I, I think, just the party. But she's getting some on herself. I think that's just because of Sarah. Um, so you just got to be really careful about that. She's uh, she got D-Protect on the Chocobo, and she got... Uh, what was it? D shell and D brave on Noel and poison, of course. So, uh, if you can try to Asuna them. It's not really that helpful to Asuna. Mostly, you just want to cure. And as soon as the aura goes away, then, you know, battle's just about over. I have my golden chocobo. I'll, I'll talk more about him later. Here's another one of the auras, but uh, we interrupted it because she staggered. So, uh, yeah, at, at this level, it's really not that bad. I'll just do an ultimate arrow and finish her off. I really, I really like the specials in this. The ultimate arrow and, uh, let's see if I can get off, what is it, Meteor Javelin. Real quick and, uh, no, whoa. Nice job, Chocobo. You got a Scourge off. And there we are, the Gorgyra Fragment. Let's go and take a look at it. We also have a bunch of uh, fragments from, um, from Vile Peaks. There was once a female warrior of Padra. I have heard your plea. You shall lose your five senses and be plunged into the black flames and wander the eternal darkness. Wow, that sounds cheery. Take a look at all of these uh, last lights from the Blitz Squadron. And as always, if, if you guys need to have a little extra time to read these, just hit the pause button. Uh, I would love to spend enough time reading all of these out loud, but as it is, I'm spending an awful lot of time on these, and I don't want to, uh, to bore everybody. Daddy's Chocobo Chick? Well, it's a girl, so I decided to call her Chocolina. I was wondering if they would show that in... I missed one here. Where is it? There is. Twilight Odin. I was wondering if they would show the Chocolina thing outside of the DLC. And they do, so I'm glad that they did. Alright. Let's see what else we can do. I've come back here to finish off a quest that I should have finished last time I was here. The recording device. You found it. Let's see here. This should be chock full of data. There's enough information in here to keep me busy for years to come. Thank you. You've been a great help. 
This breakthrough will help the military immensely. And the compensation they'll give me won't hurt either. <laughs> I can't thank you enough. Your efforts may have saved many lives. This is just a small token of my gratitude. Please, take it. We got a platinum ring. Let's get out of here before that choke wheel drives me crazy. There's one more that we can do at this point, and I'll cut to where it matters. If you remember, we we uh, did a Moogle hunt here, and this guy appeared. So let's talk to him. Me and my buddy are out here doing research on monsters in the area, but I can't get a hold of him. Can you find him? He should have some sort of message for me. All right, he's looking for his missing buddy. Find out what happened. I'm counting on you two. Oh, by the way, he's a slightly odd fellow. Natural born jokester, if you will. A jokester? All right, let's go look for him. All right, I think this might be the guy. You two make such a cute couple. A couple of what? I don't know. <laughs> My buddy asked you to come look for me to see if I'm alright? Who put you up to this? That's not funny. It's been years since he... Alright then, guys. What say we play a little game? If you can keep up with me, I'll tell you everything you want to know. Deal? Sure. Then let the game begin! Or should I say, let the pain begin! <laughs> Beat the jokester at his own game. Beat the jokester to get Lex's message. Time to make him laugh. Uh, <laughs> the, basically, there's a specific pun that you're supposed to use, and I know which ones to use, so this one. Seems to have struck his funny bone. Keep it up. I guess I have to talk to him more. Oh goodness, the puns. Need an arc? I know a guy. The book of magic was useless. They didn't run a spell check. Oh. The puns, they're painful. Not all jokes are funny. I'm proof of that. Yes, you are. <laughs> you are. Salt merchants are movers and shakers. You're magnificent. I've met my Sarah people, and I know not many can keep up. That doesn't even make sense. Have my respect. Now give it back. <laughs> I wrote everything down. Here, take this. Oh, and one other thing. Tell him that he's my one and only buddy till the day I stop breathing. You look confused. You see, the thing is, the man you talked to before, my buddy, he died three years ago. I don't mean to scare you, but you were talking to a ghost, not a person. Thanks for playing along. I had a roaring good time. We get my buddy's message. Okay, let's let's go. Let's go back to uh, Lex, because I'm done with the puns. All right, there he is. I say there's not a ghost of a chance that he's dead. You brought back the message from my buddy, did you? Oh, let's see here. He discovered a new species of monsters. Could that be the missing link beyond the realms of space-time? He did it. I knew he had it in him. What's that? You say he left me another message? He said that I'm his one and only buddy till the day that he drops dead? <laughs> That's just like him. You already know, right? I'm not like you guys. I don't belong in this world anymore. I ended up here by a simple twist of fate. If you see him again, tell him he needs to find himself a new buddy that'll watch his back. Got it? Anyway, thanks guys! We get a Ridium Ring. And we also get... The Wild Artifact. 
that's kind of important. So let's take this wild artifact and use it on this old gate over here. Because uh, I'm kind of curious to know what's behind this gate. Yashus Massif 110 AF. All right, let's go. Uh, Years go ago, here. A never before seen paradox effect haunted the Yashus Massif. The disappearances of numerous Academy staff members were followed by the discovery of strange floating orbs. Something terrible had happened, but no one knew what it might mean. A method to reverse the paradox was never found. And with the passing of the years, the Crimson Spheres simply became another part of the scenery. Alright. This looks sort of similar to the last one. We even have those or those uh, orbs there. So, um, what I'm gonna do, I've been having some minor issues. Even got the rambunctious chocobos. Uh, I need to fix my paradigms. But I just wanted to show you guys something real quick. Yes, that's right. I finally captured lightning. I maxed her out with some uh, potent crystals, which I had like 60 of them. Because I'm over leveled or something, I don't know. But she is awesome! She is the best! So, uh, let me... Let me just tune these up a little, we'll go back to wide. Go, go away from boss mode. That's, uh, I'm trying to capture, um... What's his name? Amadar, now. So that's why it's got X instead of wide. Oh, evil paradox. Where did you take Millie? This is her sister, and I'm worried about her. Worried sick, even. It's all my fault. I can't believe I left her alone after our stupid argument. She must be furious. I need to see her again so I can apologize. But I don't know if I can or ever will. I've become a victim of this mishap, too. I feel so guilty, so responsible. If only I'd been able to find the keepsake she was looking for. So, uh... And go up to Paradox. Can we carry memories over? So we're looking for the missing sister. Welcome to the fallen city of Padra, site of ancient ruins. We don't get a lot of visitors around these parts, although I'm not very surprised since there's not much to see or do here. There was a powerful paradox effect in these ruins. A group of Academy staff were investigating the area and just disappeared without a trace. That's why so many sections have been closed off. Alright, in this area, a lot of sections have been closed off, but we can finally reach 100% of the... We already have. We've already reached 100% of the map. Okay, well, we can reach 100% of the map. Uh, that's what I get for going by what the book says instead of by what I remember. Anyways, uh, we're going to go and find Millie, and I'll cut to where we find her. You know what? I might as well show lightning in action and my golden chocobo, which is kind of awesome. So uh, let's switch to try disaster. There we go. Hi, lightning. How you doing? Um, I'm gonna kill him before anything happens. Anyways, we'll switch back and I'll show Quay off. The thing I've noticed about these Pharaoh Links is the first time that you do them, they're really, really hard. But, uh, after you do them after a few times, it's a bit easier. Anyways, we're still on our... Hi, Chocobo. We're still on our way. Oh, there she is. I can see her. And we run into things. Okay, cool. I, I was not expecting. Anyways, 
Triffids? What kind of Triffid? Mandrakes. Mandrakes, not Triffids. Ah, aggression wide. And we caught one. Awesome. Do your thing, Mog. Quickly, before they... Stop running away! to me I think I think I got sucked into the paradox I remember having an argument with my sister and then I was here but I know it's not her fault it's not anyone's fault I understand that but if I know her she's blaming herself for my disappearance she must be so distraught can I ask a favor of you if you see my sister tell her that I love her very much and that none of this was her fault as much as I want to, I know I can't go home and tell her myself. I was swallowed up by the paradox. I was attacked by the monster. I... I just don't belong in this world anymore. She disappeared. Alright. Time to head back. Collect our, uh, fragment. Um... I, I read in my book that... Look, another green chocobo. I read in my book that uh, by the time we head off to start chapter 5, we could have about 120 fragments. And I only have like 90 right now. You know what? I already captured one. I don't, I don't need another one. For this next fragment, it would be a good idea to talk to Chocolina and get some, uh, get some, uh, Geisel Greens. Yes, we get to ride the rambunctious Chocobo again. I already did that. I have more than enough, which is good because I'm going to be using a bunch. But anyways, uh, I only have, like, 90 or so right now. Does it say how many I have? Maybe? 91? So I have 91 right now, and uh, I'm just going to do a little more fragment hunting before I continue with the story. What? You have something from my sister? A wedding present for me? How can that be? She knew she was in danger, but she put my happiness first up until the very end. Thank you so much. There is nothing more I can ask for. I know I'll be able to see her again somewhere, somehow. And uh, we got Gerhilda's Blossom.